Hello friends, softer bitumen is good for colder climates because it remains more flexible, while harder bitumen works better in warmer climates to prevent it from becoming too soft. So the penetration value test helps engineers to pick just the right type of bitumen to keep our roads smooth and safe. When you see a bitumen grade like 80 by 100, it indicates the softness of the bitumen. The test measures how far a needle can push into the bitumen, giving us a clear idea of its consistency. Here is how the test works. We place a standard needle on the bitumen and let it sink in for a set time under specific weight and temperature conditions. The distance the needle sinks in measured in tenths of a millimeter tells us whether the bitumen is soft or hard. So let us understand why do we perform this test. Number 1. Check Consistency The test help us determine if the bitumen is just right for various construction jobs, ensuring it has the right softness or hardness. Number 2. Determine Suitability it help us assess whether the bitumen will perform well under different weather conditions and types of projects. To carry out the penetration test, we will need the following equipments. Number 1. Container A round metal dish usually 55 mm wide and 35 mm deep. If the penetration value exceeds 225, use a larger dish that is 70 mm wide and 45 mm deep. Number 2. Needle A straight, smooth and hard steel rod for testing the bitumen. Number 3. Water bath A container with water kept at 25 degrees Celsius plus minus 0.1 degree Celsius with at least 10 liters of water. The bitumen sample should be submerged at least 100 mm below the water's surface on a perforated shelf 50 mm from the bottom. Number 4. Transfer dish or tray. It holds the container steady during the test, ensuring it's fully submerged in the water. Number 5. Penetration apparatus. A device that lets the needle sink into the bitumen with minimum friction and measures the depth in tenths of a millimeter. Number 6. Thermometer. It measures temperatures between 0 degree Celsius and 44 degree Celsius with accuracy up to 0.2 degree Celsius. Number 7. Time measuring device. A timer that tracks time accurately to 1 second. Now let us understand how to conduct the test. Number 1. Prepare the bitumen. Heat the bitumen until it is easy to pour. Stir it well to remove any air bubbles or water. Allow it to cool in a controlled environment. Number 2. Conduct the test. Fill the transfer dish with water. Place the bitumen sample in the dish. Clean the needle. Add the required weight and set it up. Lower the needle into the bitumen and let it sit for 5 seconds. Measure how far the needle has penetrated into the bitumen. Number 3. Take multiple readings. Perform the test at least 3 times on different spots on the bitumen surface. Ensure the test points are spaced out and not too close to the edge of the dish. Observations for penetration test Actual test temperature You can write down actual temperature here in degree Celsius. Penetration dial reading Record the initial and final readings for test 1, test 2 and test 3. Penetration value Calculate the average penetration value from these three test readings. Result of the test The mean penetration value is the average of these readings and tells us how soft or hard the bitumen is. Recommended penetration value of bitumen Different grades of bitumen are used based on climate and application. For warm areas, lower grades like 30 by 40 or 60 by 70 are used to prevent the bitumen from becoming too soft. For cold areas, higher grades like 80 by 100 or 180 by 200 are used 
to avoid brittleness. For spray applications, higher penetration grades are often used. These recommendations ensure that bitumen performs well in various climates and construction scenarios. So friends, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.